The first lunar mission to have ever launched from New Zealand has entered the moon's orbit. It's been a five-month journey and has been hailed as humanity's next step in going back to the moon. Lauren Hendrickson has the story. It's one small step for man. It was a moment that captivated the world. One giant leap for mankind. Rocket Lab's hoping there will be many more. Four. Three. Back in June, the company launched this electron rocket from Mahia. It was carrying NASA's capstone spacecraft. It's only the size of a microwave and has spent months travelling to a unique lunar orbit, which has never been flown before. Really, it's the first step to sending humans back to the moon. That's because if all goes to plan, the lunar orbit will be home to NASA's future space station. To provide engineers and astronauts and scientists a, a place to live and work um, as part of their program to descend down to the lunar surface and, and learn more about living on other planets. Rocket Lab's involvement in this operation has already been a success. This next critical step in the mission is over to NASA and Advanced Space, which is the company operating Capstone. That final nail-biting manoeuvre in the journey took place around 1.20 this afternoon. Hundreds of thousands of things have to go right when you're talking about space flight and things in space. Only one thing has to go wrong. But early data has already indicated it was executed as planned. Advanced Space tweeting congratulations for the mission, which involved many different teams. And the team here in New Zealand um, and our international team were really at the forefront of, of that first next step into um, interplanetary transportation. Successfully launching not only the rocket behind it, but a new era of space exploration. Lauren Hendrickson, News Hub.